Good afternoon, everyone. Happy World Water Day. My name is Caitlin. I'm an assistant educator here at the Florida Oceanographic Society. I am also a professional engineer in the state of Florida, and I worked in wastewater. So in, on behalf of World Water Day, I wanna to talk to you guys a little bit about why wastewater matters and how you can help us keep our waters clean. So wastewater unfortunately can contribute a lot of nutrients to our water bodies, both surface water and groundwater. That's a pretty big problem. It can lead to some pretty nasty algae blooms. So whenever we can, we wanna keep wastewater and sewage out of our water bodies. Ways that you can help us do that. The first one, be really careful what you flush and what you put down the drain. I know it sounds like it doesn't really make a big impact, but anything that's not a biological material or toilet paper can lead to some pretty big clogs in the wastewater system. And in the kitchen, things like grease or oils can also contribute to those clogs. So if it looks like dental floss, hair, or even flushable wipes, you wanna throw those things away. If you ever have any doubt, throw it out because if we put those things down the drain or down the toilet, they could lead to really big clogs, which leads to raw sewage ending up in our water bodies because our systems can get uh, clogged and can overflow. The second thing you can do, if you're on a septic tank and you have the option to switch to sewer, try to do that as soon as you can. Advanced wastewater treatment can help us reduce the levels of nutrients in our wastewater and keep them out of our groundwater. If you don't have the option to switch to sewage, make sure that you are maintaining your septic system. Septic systems need to be maintained on a regular basis every couple of years by a professional. And the last thing is whenever you have to dig in your yard or you're thinking about planting a new tree, make sure you call before you dig and you know where your wastewater infrastructure is. If we accidentally plant trees or other vegetation directly on top of those pipelines, it can cause lots of breakages and ultimately spill that raw wastewater into the ground where it ends up in the aquifer. If you do these three simple things, you can help us keep those wastewater nutrients out of our water where they don't belong and help keep the waters clean. Happy World Water Day, everyone.